Hey love folks, it's Ross, I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thank you so much for being you. You know, you're reaching out to me, you know, you're getting assistance from me as I'm getting assistance from you and we're just helping each other get on that positive path. So you keep doing what you need to do. And with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you are comfortable enough, please go ahead and drop me a line or two. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content in my video, or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. And if you feel like the you know, the video has been informative to you and it gave you good vibes you would love to share with a loved one or friend, please go ahead and do so. And while you're at it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. And once again, thank you for the love and support that you are giving me in the channel. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today, I'm listening to Try Yourself. Miracles happen within a minute. Get a good, get a good... Get a good news fast manifest meditation. And I'll post that link in the description box below. We all got some stuff that we, you know, we're wishing on that we, you know, we want to hear hear back from. You probably got raises that you're trying to hear back from, or you're trying to, you know, get a loan for a house, or you're trying to get, you know, get seal your, you know, sign a signature towards a house or something like that. You got something that you're going towards. So, you know, I'm trying to send that good vibes towards you that you're able to get that, you know, that, that abundance to come in your life. So, you know, go ahead and I'll post that link down below if you want to go ahead and meditate towards it yourself. But anyways, my video today, I'm doing story time. How I found out I was a hey Oka. Mickey Morgan, thank you so much, Sister Love, for asking me this question. She asked me a really good question, you know. Somebody asked me this a long time ago, and I went ahead and typed it up and never thought about, you know, saying how I found out. You know, I did videos about this, like, months and months and months and months and months ago. And it was like, I kept constantly having dreams about different chiefs like I would see them and it would be beautiful like I could be taking pictures of them and they're like they're doing their Indian dance they're doing the rain dance they're coming together like I would see myself uh, taking pictures of them or you know dreams or visions of them talking to me giving me different wisdom and I'm just like they're talking in their language but yet I'm understanding them and I'm just like if they were to do that now, like if somebody types to me, and I don't know what kind of language they call that, but, uh, you know, I'm still used, new to this. So it's like different things that came off of being a Hayoka. So it was just like different dreams I would have. Like I would be in a tent, and we'll, we'll be smoking a peace pipe. And they're just giving me this different knowledge, and I'm asking the chief, what is this that you're trying to tell me? And it's like you will find out. A uh, little Hayoka or something. I forgot what they were calling me. It was like little Hayoka or whatever. And I'm like, what is little Hayoka? Why you keep calling me that? That's not my name. It's like, yes, that is your true form, little little Hayoka. So it was just like different times. Like I would see myself putting on this war paint, and I'll be just jumping around, and then they'll be you, you know laughing, and I'll be telling stories at the same time, and people would be giving me hugs, and it was just like. I didn't know what this was telling me. This was like almost, 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 almost close to a year ago. And it was just like more and more dreams would come to me that I couldn't really understand or I was just trying to find meaning to. And then all of a sudden that I was watching YouTube and next thing you know, I seen that Hayoka again. And I was just like, oh my God, this is weird. And I started seeing these things and I was like over tear with joy because it was like, you know, finding out I was a Hayoka, it, it, it broke down every characteristic I've ever did in life. You know, I did everything ass backwards. My mom had problems with me being born. Um, uh, it was just like, I always took the hard way of life, you know, of learning things, you know, healing from them. You know, to me, a Hayoka is a sacred clown, you know, a person that helps other people out, you know, and they, they have to do that smack back in reality type way of doing it. They don't do it like normal people when they come to you. It is just like something that is like a, 
it's a just in a moment thing or you know it is it seems surprising but yet so familiar to you it is just to me it's just so many different things that you know Hayoka means to me and it's like I love it you know I really love it even though I'm not really in touch with the you know the Native American you know tradition and their religion and stuff like that you know I grew up around Indians um or Native Native Americans, my, my bad. I don't need to be offended anybody, so let me say a Native American. Um, one of my family members, you know, they were married into the family, and they used to teach me a lot of stuff. She was like, I think she said something about White Coat and Cherokee. I don't know what a White Coat is, but White Coat and Cherokee or something like that. Um, and she used to teach me a lot of stuff when I was little, and I used to, you know, be really close to her as a child and it was just more and more things it's just like you know as i found out white witch and twin flame all the other stuff it just when i asked the universe to give me that knowledge to seek the unseen to know what i need to know you know i just start having things come to me whether if it was in vision or synchronicities or a post or just videos that i would come up with or just something that I would type up and I'm just like where did this come from or I'll blurt out my mouth and next thing you know I'll start typing it up and see what did this mean and that's how things I would start finding out about myself when it came to being a Hayoka so it's just like I feel like they they say that we are like a higher tribe of the empaths I think that's what they call it where we have um all these different things that Sorry, y'all, I forgot to turn my sound off on my phone. But, you know, it's just all these different things that come along with that. You know, you're helping other people along their path. You're mirroring what they need to see about themselves. And I didn't realize I used to do that because, it's like, I used to tell people, this is your problem and this and that. But it was just like I didn't have a right way of going about it because I just didn't care. It was like, okay, this is the truth. I didn't care how it came out. But now I'm just more, you know, I use discernment and just watch how I put my words out when it comes to things that I mirror out to people. Sometimes it comes out. I don't want it to come out like brutal or being, you know, vague or anything like that. You know, you're just being really hurtful towards anybody. You just try to teach them along their way because this is something I've been through. I'm trying to warn you of what I've been through already so you don't have to go through that. You know, it's just like I'm trying to show you this. I'm like, look, I went through this and this and this and that. Now I'm trying to tell you. You know, so you don't have to go through all this so you can go ahead and nip it in the bud now. But if you take off, you know, doing the same things, the same route I did, you're going to have to go through the same problems I had to suffer with. So it's just like a, a lot of times I had to tell people that. So it's just learning about the things that you need to know about yourself is such a true blessing. Finding out, being a Hayoka and being able to help people, knowing you're that sacred clown, that you can bring goofiness to the table, as well as bringing your story too. You know, you're bringing hope to somebody's life, as well as positivity, as well as entertainment too as well, because it's like anytime somebody comes to my, my videos, I mean, I, I'm straight blunt with it, but I have these weird metaphors, and I'm trying to, you know, I'm just that crazy good kind of fun. So I hope you are able to resonate with the video. Uh, I'm giving a post notification shout out to Mickey Morgan. She's new to the family. Much love to you, sis. And thank you for stopping by and giving me such an interesting question. You know, if y'all have any other questions about any other things that, you know, I can openly be able to answer, I have no problem with putting it in the content. And, you know, I'm putting it up for a video and just giving you a shout out about the video if you don't mind me doing that. So, send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. I hope everybody had a blessed, safe weekend. And I'm sending out infinite abundance, love, and light. And healing vibes and uplifting vibes if you truly need them. Know that you're blessed, truly favored, and highly loved. And know that there is always somebody out there praying for your better days. Give me a thumbs up, like, and even share on your social media favorite. Drop me a line. I love the chance to hear from you. And as always, go ahead and like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video. Until then, much love, peace, and be wild. And see you on my next video. And yeah, come see me on live chat. I usually do one in the noontime and one in the at in the evening time as well. You all have a good time. You, there's no judgment. You can say what you want to say. If you're struggling with something, we send you help. We send you prayers. And you know, keep your vibes lifted when you're going through anything. So you know when you leave there, you're never, 
You come in there, you feel sad, you leave with laughter and love. So I hope you come by and join us. Peace.